Now let's get down to business. I always make a disclaimer in any speech because my subject might make you a little uncomfortable if you're not comfortable with yourself as a Muslim. Secondly, my subject might make you a little uncomfortable if you're too comfortable with yourself as a Muslim while discrimination, prejudice, bigotry, racism still exists inside and outside of our ummah. You see, my subject today is an attempt to inspire you into action self-confidence and seeking to make you be authentic and comfortable with yourself as a Muslim. You see, being a Muslim in America, whether you serve in public service or serving as a soldier, you have the right without equivocation, without apology and without fear to practice your religion. You see, my subject today will come from Surah Al-Fajr. Fajr in Arabic means the dawn, the new beginning, going forth in abundance, going gushing forth like a spring. So the Fajr says, As for man, when his Lord tries him and is generous to him, he hits his chest with puffed out pride and said, my Lord has honored me. But the next verse says, But when he straightens his means of persistence, subsistence, he says, my Lord has humiliated me. You see, I specifically chose this surah because Fajr is the dawn. It's a time when the light is piercing through the crowd. It's a time when you wake up and pray for Allah's strength mercy, and forgiveness. You see, Fajr, for us as Muslims, is a new dispensation. We can't be afraid like those people of old. We can't bow down just because others were afraid to be who they were. We are ready to rise and take our place in the sun. We are ready to make Raku and Sajda to the Lord of the world. We are ready to go forth. You see, this journey as a Muslim, it's not for the faint of heart. It's a journey of persistence, patience, and perseverance. Listen to me. You are not only ambassadors for the world, you are ambassadors for your own household, your children, who are weighing you every day on what a Muslim is and what a Muslim is not. What a responsibility that is. And we have no right to shrink in that responsibility. 